Okay, and we're back thrill seekers. Uh, this time we're back with a version of a torque force motor uh, with a, or a, I think it's actually a homopolar motor, but uh, go back and have a look at the other vids and what the origins of this is. It's changed quite a bit. I've only got the one inductor on it now. As you can see, there's a bit of movement in there and a bit of noise. Um, let me just stop it for you. We've only got the, I'm going to have to glue this one down, but this is about, oops, uh, this is about 1,500, well, actually it's about 1,600 turns of one mil wire. Uh, magnets, opposite poles facing in, and um, yeah, single inductor, uh, three and a half kilo flywheel, um, transformer, steels as our um, plates. The uh, that's about it. Just doing a uh, Hall effect switch here, not an optic switch. At the moment, it's on about twelve volts. It'll use about oh, about 100 milliamps just under 100 about 90 milliamps current uh the coil itself it's got about a kilo of wire on there um the resistance of that is about three and a half ohms so if anything i'd probably want to put another 200 grams on there uh, to get it up to about four ohms probably where I'd like it. Um, that was just the first run, so a bit of work to do yet.